Hello and welcome to Nation Innovation. Today we are going to discuss something more in Spintronix and today's talk Spin Transfer Torque. This can be referred to also as STT and RAM that is magnetic random access memory so we will be going to study about how this STT RAM works what is STT M RAM so as we have already discussed about the MTJ so in STT M RAM what we have is a basic MTJ structure One is the pin layer, another is the free layer, and this is the turn layer. So, from here we have a access transistor that is for right, and similarly. We have a access transistor here for read. Uh, well, these transistors can be eliminated also by directly by directly applying the current sources. We can generate the write current as well as the read current. And one more important thing is that the right current is always greater than the read current so uh, how it basically works let's discuss about that also so for right current for writing we have this MTJ let us now denote the pin layer magnetization for example by let's suppose it is oriented towards this now when we apply the conventional current that is the right current from here this pin layer it generates the spin current it polarizes the spin of incoming electrons and the spin current is generated here and similarly what we have is in the free layer what we have for example, if if initially the orientation is the orientation of magnetization is in opposite direction, then the electrons which are going here they apply a torque torque here, and this torque is exerted on the electrons present in the free layer and then they simultaneously exert the torque on the free layer magnetization and it switches now in detail uh, we can see that okay for example initial magnetization was this and the incoming electrons spin current magnetization is like this then the net magnetization of this and the polarized is this so the net magnitude it will change to somewhat like this and then slowly to this then this and then finally it will be in this final state so what we call this whole process is 
from initial state of anti parallel this is called the anti parallel state and what we have arrived is this parallel state so this is called the writing and this writing is basically due to this spin torque transfer mechanism and similarly for right for right for uh, pardon so similarly for read operation what we do is we provide the read current through this okay so it will and read current is obviously less than the right current so it will not disturb the switching of the magnetization so it will just tell that whether the whether the resistance of this MTJ structure is low or high and from that resistance value we can infer that whether the configuration is anti-parallel or parallel so now let us just brief about the key point either logic 0 or 1 that is parallel or anti-parallel resistance and then we have this configuration that 1 MTJ along with 1 or 2 transistors then what we see here is that there is a single path there is a single path for both reading and writing and this leads to the hence there are several shoes with STT RAM faces many shoes regarding the read-write disturbance or we can say that uh, unintended switching So these are the some of the key points regarding to STTM RAM and uh, we will learn more about Spintronics concepts in our upcoming videos.